morning, baby time friends. I'm Andrea, and this is Baby Time, a story time for babies up to 18 months old. We start baby time with our hi, hello, and how are you song, so baby can practice waving hello. This is Bear. Bear is my demonstration baby. Would you like to wave hello? Hello. Good morning. Let's sing hello. Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you today? And then we clap hands. Hi, hello, and clap your hands. Clap your hands. Clap your hands. Hi, hello, and clap your hands. How are you today? Hello, parents. Hello, grandparents. Hello caregivers. Hello babies. Welcome to baby time. Let's make our hands clap some more. Can you make your hands clap? Yay! That's good. Let's sing our clapping song. Oops. Here we go. Make your hands go clap, clap, clap. Clap, clap, clap. Clap, clap, clap. Make your hands go clap, clap, clap. My sweet baby. Should we do that again? Clapping hands is so fun. Make your hands go clap, 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 clap. Make your hands go clap, 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 my sweet baby. Okay, now we're going to do a fun lap bounce called putting on the plate. And grown-ups, first we chant putting on the plate. And then we chant um, candies in the jar, and then we chant bacon in the pan. Like that. Here we go. Putting on the plate, putting on the plate, wibble wobble, wibble wobble, putting on the plate. Candies in the jar, candies in the jar, shake them up, shake them up, candies in the jar. Bacon in the pan, bacon in the pan. Turn it round, turn it round, bacon in the pan. Was that fun? Shall we do it again? If you're vegetarian, just say tofu in the pan. Here we go. Putting on the plate, putting on the plate. Wibble wobble, wibble wobble, putting on the plate. Candies in the jar, candies in the jar. Shake them up, shake them up, candies in the jar. Bacon in the pan, bacon in the pan. Turn it round, turn it round, bacon in the pan. Yay, so fun. Okay, next we're gonna sing Skin of a Rink. This is a nice lullaby if you don't know it. Here we go. Skin of a rink, a dink, a dink, skin of a rink, a do. I love you. Skin a marink a dink a dink, skin a marink a do. I love you. I love you in the morning and in the afternoon. I love you in the evening underneath the moon. Skin a marink a dink a dink, skin a marink a do. I love you. Hooray! Okay, next we're going to show you. The diaper changing song, which also can be the getting dressed song. Here we go. This is um, Baby Put Your Pants On, and um, it goes to the tune of Shortening Bread. Here we go. You ready to get dressed, baby? Baby, put your pants on, pants on, pants on. Baby, put your pants on. One, two, three. Baby, put your pants on, pants on, pants on. Baby, put your pants on. One, two, three. Leg to the left, leg to the right. Wiggle and jiggle and pull them on tight. Leg to the left, leg to the right. Wiggle and jiggle and pull them on tight. And you can do the shirt, too. Let's pretend. Let's do baby, put your shirt on. Baby, put your shirt on, shirt on, shirt on. Baby, put your shirt on. One, two, three. 
Baby put your shirt on, shirt on, shirt on. Baby put your shirt on. One, two, three. Arm to the left, arm to the right. Wiggle and jiggle and pull it on tight. Arm to the left, arm to the right. Wiggle and jiggle and pull it on tight. Very good. There you go. That one can relieve a lot of frustration on the changing table um, when you're trying to get baby dressed and they have other ideas. You sit right over here. Oh no, you're going to stay here. We're going to do our peekaboo song with our scarves. So get your scarf if you have a scarf or a napkin or piece of fabric, or just use your hands if you don't have one ready. This is how our favorite peekaboo song goes. Peekaboo, peekaboo, I see you, I see you, I see your button nose, I see your tiny toes, I see you, peekaboo. That's our peekaboo song. Shall we do that again? Let's do that more. Peekaboo, peekaboo, I see you, I see you, I see your button nose, I see your tiny toes, I see you, peekaboo. <laughs> okay, next we're going to do Jack in the Box. Any regulars in baby time remember Jack in the Box? Stick your scarves in your fist like that. And we say, Jack in the Box, sit so still. Won't he come out? Yes, he will. Let's do that one more time. Just bunch up the fabric in your fist and say, Jack in the Box, sit so still. Will he come out? Yes, he will. Ha <laughs> ha. What a surprise, huh? So we've been learning some sign language in baby time. A couple weeks ago, uh, I taught you milk, which is making squeezing a fist, milk. And we also learned more. Just pinch your fingers together, more. That's a helpful one. If baby wants more of anything, they can learn to ask you for more before they can say it. Um, we also learned all done, all done, just put your hands out, all done. So a few of our babies in baby time know lots of signs like that. I'm learning new ones all the time. And it relieves a lot of frustration for you and for baby to be able to know what, what baby wants or what baby needs. Um, a new one that's really helpful is hurt, hurt. And what you can do is point your fingers where your hurt is and, um, Babies as young as six months can start to sign um, once uh, if you've been signing for, for them to them for several weeks. So if you sign, if let's say you bang your head and you can sign hurt. I banged my head, it hurts. Or you know, I banged my knee, hurts. I do it all the time. Um, after a while your baby can start letting you know if something hurts and where it hurts. Um, I told the story of a baby who was teething and the baby was crying at night. Parents didn't know why the baby was so upset, and the baby signed hurt by his gums, and they understood what was wrong, and so they could help him. So it's a really, it's a really great thing, and it stimulates communication also. Okay, enough of that. The babies are like, this is boring. Let's go on to the next one. Let's do our shaker song. You have a shaker? Here's my yellow shaker from the library. I'm going to shake my shaker up. And shake my shaker down. Shake my shaker to the side. And shake it all around. Shake it on your shoulder. Shake it on your head. Shake it on your knees. And tuck them into bed. Let's do that shaker uh, chant again more quickly. Here we go. Shake your shaker up. And shake your shaker down. Shake your shaker to the side and shake it all around. Shake it on your shoulder. Shake it on your head. Shake it on your knees and tuck them into bed. Good night, shakers.
Wasn't that fun? Okay. We're going to get the ukulele, okay, Bear? So you hang out over here. Um, we've been singing um, a love song, a lullaby called Yo Te Amo. And we sang Yo Te Amo means I love you in Spanish. And you can insert how you say I love you in your home language if you say I love you a different way. Um, we also sang Je t'aime for I love you. I'm just going to sing Yo Te uh, Yo te amo again today. And you can put in the comments if you want me to sing I love you in a different language next week. Here we go. It goes like this. Nice bedtime lullaby. Yo te amo, yo te amo. All day long I sing this little song to you. Yo te goodbye song the more we get together. Will you sing with me? I sure do love getting together with you. Here we go. The more we get together 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 the more we get together the happier we'll be cause your friends are my friends and my friends are friends for coming to baby time. I will see you next week. Bye-bye.